The Pacific region is among the most remote in the world. Countries have populations spread across vast distances of ocean. The Kingdom of Tonga is no exception, made up of over 170 islands, creating distinct challenges for development. In Tonga we have uh, about 55 doctors for a population of 100,000. In Australia, for the same population, you'll have 265 doctors. So as a result, the services we provide to outer islands is provided by medical assistants and nurse practitioners. And so there are occasions where they would like to have detailed discussions with the general doctors that are working on the main hospital. So at the moment, the internet, unfortunately, is very expensive. And we've only been able to get a limited bandwidth, which is not enough for the purposes of, of what we really need. To help improve internet services, the World Bank, together with partners, has funded the construction of an 827 kilometer fiber optic cable connecting Tonga to the Southern Cross Cable Network via Fiji. Development of this fiber optic cable will enable us to have better connection, and as a result, the better connection would make us better institution in providing the services than we do for the patient, in collecting information from our health information system, in getting better diagnosis for the patients that we're seeing, and also in liaising with our partners overseas to provide the best treatment possible that we can offer for the patients. Development of this fiber optic cable will allow our doctors to communicate better with the doctors overseas. We have live surgery where we have partners overseas who are having a live feed to what is happening here in Tonga and they are directing the doctors to what to do in complicated surgery. I mean, we can't wait for the day that that will happen, but more so we can't wait for the day the cable will arrive here and we'll get the better service. For Tonga, better connectivity is expected to improve health services and bring many other gains, from opportunities for business development, education services, and disaster management.